here today in uh, the Holiday Inn in Marlboro, and uh, we have the uh, commander of the uh, Military Order of the Purple Heart in Massachusetts, uh, Leo Agnew. Uh, Leo Agnew hails from uh, Clinton, Massachusetts, and uh, how are you doing, doing today, Leo? Fine, fine, thank you. And uh, what is uh, going on today in this uh, today and tomorrow uh, here at the Holiday Inn in Marlboro? Well, this is a, a convention for uh, 2011, uh, Department of Massachusetts, and we're here honoring the first female Purple Heart, Purple Heart recipient from Massachusetts, coming up from Walter Reed Hospital in Washington, D.C. Boy, that sounds very interesting. Uh, what is her name? Do you remember? Her yeah, her name is Deidre May Neely. Okay, uh, she was injured then, a Purple Heart uh, recipient, member of your organization? Yes, yeah, she's a life member of Chapter 441 in Middleborough. Okay, and uh, she, she's coming right directly from Walter Reed in uh, Washington? Yeah, she's a medic at Walter Reed along with her husband. Oh, she's making a uh, career of the service? Yes, yeah, she was uh, wounded on August 27, 2009 in, in Afghanistan. Uh-huh. How, how many members uh, do you have in the, your organization? Uh, in the Department of Mass, we have 542 members. Yeah, all Purple Heart recipients? Yes. Uh, tell me briefly what the Purple Heart is. Uh, some people uh, ask me, I say, gee, what's, what's Purple Heart mean? It's the oldest decoration in the history of military today that is still issued. It dates back to George Washington. And uh, to be awarded a Purple Heart, you have to be in a combat situation and shed blood. And it has to be uh, recorded from a medic or a doctor. 